Hello everybody, this is Bui from Mama Bui's Kitchen. I hope you are having a great day. In today's baking episode, guys, we are going to be making blueberry banana bread. So guys, let's get started. You know Mama Bui doesn't like to waste time. Let's start with the ingredients you are going to need. Flour, oil, buttermilk sugar blueberries vanilla extract baking soda salt lemon zest and ripe bananas this recipe works well with ripe and spotty bananas let's move this aside and move on to work on our dry ingredients sift together all-purpose flour baking soda and salt there are three purposes of sifting flour first is to remove impurities or lumps secondly aeration and even mixing of ingredients you know if the flour stays for a long time start to be lumpy next transfer the sifted dry ingredients into a bowl then set aside for later use now let's move on to work on the bananas Place the bananas in a medium bowl, then using a fork, mash the bananas. I always leave small chunks of bananas, guys. That's how I like mine to be. <laughs> now, let's move on to work on the wet ingredients. In a large bowl, combine oil and sugar. Mix well to combine. next ingredient we are going to add is the lemon zest guys it's going to give this bread lemon citrusy flavor which i love so much <laughs> mix well until well combined next we are going to add in vanilla extract and mashed bananas most people don't like chunks of bananas in their bread so if you are one of those people make sure that you mash the bananas thoroughly to be honest with you once this bread is baked you can even see those chunks of bananas next we are going to add flour alternately with the milk we're gonna start with the flour and ending with the flour add half of the flour mix well until well incorporated next we are going to add buttermilk and mix well you cannot believe how moist this blueberry banana bread is guys and without any eggs now with the remaining flour i'm gonna scoop out one tablespoon of flour then toss the blueberries with the flour now we are going to add the remaining flour and mix well do not over mix guys Next, gently fold blueberries into the batter by tossing the blueberries in a little flour before you add them to the batter will keep them from sinking to the bottom of your loaf bread. So guys, keep that in mind. One thing I like about this recipe, guys, is so versatile. You can customize this loaf to add your own touch. Some great additions to these are orange zest, coconut, or white chocolate chips next use a spatula to scrape the sides of the bowl and make sure that everything is well incorporated we're gonna go ahead and grease the loaf pan with the non-stick baking spray next we're gonna pour the batter into the grease pan 
it's very crucial to grease the loaf pan before baking the bread by doing so it helps the bread not to stick to the pan next we're gonna use the spatula to flatten the top then top with extra blueberries for decoration this recipe doesn't call for eggs but this bread is so moist and delicious guys i hope you will try this recipe and if you do let us know how it turned out for you in the comment section down below now it's time to bake our bread we're gonna bake the bread at 350 degrees fahrenheit for one hour or until toothpick inserted in the middle of the bread comes out clean the bread is out of the oven i'm gonna allow it to sit in the pan for 10 minutes before i invent it onto a cooling rack to cool completely i'm sorry for this part guys i forgot to do the toothpick test you can do that to make sure your bread is done now the bread is cooled down completely i'm gonna slice it to show you how it looks inside i hope you enjoyed this video guys consider subscribing share it with your friends and your family don't forget to subscribe until next time guys bye honey for my honey bye my honey